Hello, friends. Today, we will honestly discuss a topic that concerns almost everyone. Why does the internet speed sometimes drop when using NordVPN? And can this be fixed? VPN and speed, how does it work? When you connect to a VPN, your traffic is encrypted. It passes through a secure server. It may cross other countries. Sometimes it goes through additional filtering levels, e.g. threat protection. This puts a strain on your connection speed. Reasons for speed drops with NordVPN. 1. Encryption NordVPN uses AES-256 encryption, which is secure but resource-intensive. 2. Server distance The further away the server, the greater the delay. For example, connecting from Europe to a server in the US almost always results in a noticeable drop in speed. 3. Server load Sometimes the server is overloaded. Even in a premium network, the load can vary throughout the day. Your local connection, unstable Wi-Fi, poor ISP quality, congested home network, video streaming, torrents, cloud updates, background software, and antivirus. Some programs may conflict with the VPN tunnel. Why NordVPN is generally faster than its competitors? Uses the NordLynx WireGuard protocol? It minimizes speed loss. RAM-only servers that process requests faster. Extensive network, 7,300 plus servers worldwide. But even with NordVPN, the physics of the internet still apply. And if the settings are wrong, the speed drops. How to fix slow speeds. Step 1. Always use NordLynx settings, VPN protocol, NordLynx. It provides the best balance of speed and security. Step 2. Choose the closest servers. The closer the server, the faster the speed. There's no point in connecting to distant regions without a reason. Step 3. And switch to a less congested server. If the server starts to slow down, switch to another one in the same region. Step 4. Disable threat protection during the test. Sometimes it slightly reduces speed when filtering traffic intensively. Step 5. Connect a cable instead of Wi-Fi. A wired connection always provides a stable channel for a VPN. Step 6. Close background programs, updates, torrents, cloud syncing. All of these can eat up bandwidth. My personal work setup, NordLynx always. Nearest optimized servers. Wired connection. Background processes under control. A little about the price in 2025. Two years of NordVPN, $3.39 per month. Plus three months free, ESIM with 10 gigabytes of data, up to 10 devices, and a 30-day money-back guarantee. The bottom line is simple. VPNs always have a slight impact on speed. But with the right settings, you won't even notice the difference with NordVPN, and you'll remain completely secure. The link to NordVPN is below this video. All bonuses are in the pinned comment. If you found this video useful, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and see you in the next episodes of VPN Unlocked.